special test, they'll be coming the other way, they've got to negotiate that, you know, first out, well somebody, the leader stalls it, wow, they can hold up the next four, and the four after that. One, three, five, that, that bit's jolly. Oh, we got it wrong. You try and work out where the riders are going. They've got the same up there, spirals everywhere. This supposed to be spiral Sunday. I'm just doing general filming from a distance. Or oh, in this day and age, it's keep your distance. The water meter and the gas meter apart. Or an electric meter makes the three meters apart. Wow. a bit more, a bit more in the distance there. Mm -hmm. I have no idea what I'm getting to see the going to back come here. Them up. I tell you, the special test is going to be interesting. That's a bit too tight for them. I think the lads have done a wonder on this course. What they laid out, using everything that's available to us. I make good use of it. They should be well and truly congratulated. They enjoy the sport and they put a lot back into it.
again trouble the viewfinder, I can't see what it's doing. But this is the Sparrow on the first field. Don't forget, today is Sparrow Sunday. Tomorrow is a Manic Monday. All right, look at that, two, two Dave Roper team members there going head to head, or bike to bike. I think the changeover is coming again soon. We'll be into the second hour. You work this out. This is the one of the spirals. And, uh, I just love them. They get a bit confused. Even watch it, you get confused. But it, it does come back on itself in the end. And they go up. So the start and finish. Oh yes, in the distance you can see the riders there waiting. They're waiting for their minute to come up. It's a four minute lap today. So every minute they're late, they lose a quarter of a lap. So they're waiting for their time to come up. Others are going straight through. Can I zoom in a bit more? I can't be filming it separately. One of the star ladies of the show there walking up there, Liz Herbert, doing a lot of filming, capturing with her son, Evan. Lucky lad he is, very lucky. Still two there waiting. Got to go over, and in the distance there you can see by the caravan is where the trans well, transponder receivers are. The transponder does tag straps. You played tag before. That rider's on to another lap. These two are still waiting. Well, if you've got two minutes before your time's up, or is it three minutes, one minute, you're not going to do another lap. Just hope the bike start. Meanwhile, back at the spiral. Coming to the distance again. Two fresh riders for that, I think. Three now waiting to, for the clock to pick over to that minute. I'm going to be filming here for three minutes. Now so that one's gone, he's, he's, he's timed up. He's minutes up. Swipe the transponder. And he's gone into the pits, yes. Into the Park Ferme. I've got trouble coming towards me here. Well, back to the spiral, and virtually gone. But it's about 3 minutes to 12 at the moment. So, they'll be coming in for the half hour lunch break. I see Jamie Roper in the distance there, and it goes through the spiral. Try to get in a bit closer. Here he comes now. Getting back to his old self. Or young self, shall I say. There he goes up to the... Now, is he going to come in or is he going for another lap? That is four minutes a lap. Now, I think he's going to chance it. Is he going to chance his luck? He's going to chance his luck? Yes, he's going for another lap. And he's got to go for it. There's about two minutes left on signal two. There it goes. Now, he's going to be late in, but as long as he's not more than four minutes late, four minutes plus, he's gained something. 109's going there. He's got a little bit longer than Jamie. So one, two, three, and four. 
number seven there to my left. So time is nearly up. Otherwise, they're going to be the first one is going to be late. I know Jamie's going to be late in. But he's decided to go for another lap. I'm looking for like 102, 103, 104. Seven four. Those, I love this spiral, I really do. You would say, where are they going? The riders look like side by side, but they are, but on a different stretch of the track. Now, is that Ricky Roper? No, it's a, it's a low digit number. It's going to be a low digit budget. They're going for other laps in the distance. I think so. He's going for another lap. Here's another. One four six. Thirty seven has been number eight. One one zero number eight. So you went out second number eight, I should say. Yeah, it's just got He's in the second wave, so he should be in at 12.02. We're about 20 seconds now to 12.01. They can be, they can get in at 12, 12.59. And they wouldn't be late, because they're still on the same minute, but once it gets to 12.01, they're late! Right, they're going out there very fast. One one eight, he's got time. Look at them, this spiral. I just love this spiral. Think of a pop song that could be like to it. Of course. Call me Rose. Dizzy. You drive me dizzy. Coming in, are they coming in? They're way to go over there. So they're going to be interesting. 109 coming through there. That's interesting. Do you think he's going to go for another, another lap? Which he could do because he needs to be in at three minutes past the time. A rider's coming in over there, so each side. 109 on each side. Call it in. Look at the Jamie Rover. Well, it's 12.03, it's just come up on my clock. 12.03 on my watch, which is an accurate watch. No sign of Jamie Roper. No sign of Jamie Roper. Whether he's overcooked it, I don't know. I think he's going to be more than four minutes late. Four minutes, four minutes plus late. So if he's four minutes. The lap he's done is a waste of time. I'm looking to my right all the time. That's a PJ. 
Jay Roper man, I'm sure. Where is Jamie? Where is Jamie? Where are you Jamie? I think you've uh, done a bum lap. No sign of Jamie Roper. It's at 12.05 now on my watch and I haven't seen Jamie Rover. Of course, as I missed him, I could do it quite easy. <coughs> After a few drinks, I could be missed. Not these days, I'm not allowed to. I recommended not to. I see Andy Mason there, number 58. Probably the oldest rider on the course, and he, he can show these youngins what to do. Oh, here comes Andy Mason now. The, He's the second of these two riders, number 58. Or the 38, could be 30. Anyway, it's only most with the 8 at the end. Let's go over there, we can see them coming. Probably could be their last lap, could be another lap after that. Andy Mason. <laughs> He's got another lap in him. Here he comes now, Andy Mason, 38. It is 38, confirmation. They'll all be in in the next five, ten minutes, they'll all be in. 